hello and welcome to my channel where we make structural engineering design simple and easy my name is Olodu Konyedi and I'm your host we want to appreciate everyone everybody that has subscribed to our channel we are not taking that for granted we appreciate you all we appreciate you all uh, subscribers we do do appreciate you and all those sending wonderful comments and encouraging words we say we thank you very much and those who are yet to subscribe please hit the subscribe button so that you will be part of the people that get notified whenever we put up quality content like this we have a lot of encouraging words and um, some some questions and today we we'll have um, a denola okay a denola okay you said well done sir we appreciate you ma a denola okay a dunola a dunola okay I appreciate you ma the lord bless you we have a, a loco a loco you said thank you very much sir i have benefited a lot from your tutorial my name is joe j from kuala lumpe malawi please advise how to make continuous beam become simply supports eg a three span continuous beam we want to edit it to become simply supported beam thank you very much again you are now my guru wow thank you very much j alioko alioko I appreciate that wonderful uh, one from Malawi, Malawi, Kuala Lumpur. I appreciate you, sir. I appreciate that. So, if I understand your question, but if I don't, please feel free to comment and tell tell me exactly how it is. I will try to explain and answer the question based on how I understood your question. So if if is not the real question that I'm, I'm answering, please comment and let me know the exact thing you mean by converting a continuous beam to simply support, say, e.g. a three-span beam. A three span beam we want to edit it to become simply support beam thank you very much again i appreciate that okay let's assume let me assume i understand what you are asking let me assume that so but if not please feel free and comment so this is our axis line let's make this 230 by 230 230 by 230 so so we've added or please check our previous video i'm not explaining everything from scratch please check our previous videos we'll go to our beam we say 230 by 450 uh, then we add it I will not um, explain everything from scratch. Okay, let's assume this is the three span that you are talking about. Let's put our slab. Let's make it 150. Let's make it 150 by 150. We'll go to the load. Two by 2.2. .2. Let's say we make this one okay let's assume let's assume this let's assume 
this so you are saying this is three continuous beam how can I make this and this and this simply support if I'm right please a comment let me know what you are asking is this three span we want you want only this to be simply support if I'm right let me know if I'm right let me know you can do it in two ways two ways you can either remove these columns and make this bean span all through here but that will be too long because from here to here is 5 meter 5 meter so it's 15 meter it will be too long so but let's assume you have a 2, two meter span let's assume if this is 2 meter 2 meter 2 meter so if you take out this for example this is the first method we'll do you take out this you take out this hmm? You take out this you take out this and this you take out this please check our previous video I won't be explaining how I'm doing all this they've all been done before so you come here with this now you can now um, make all this you've made this three span become one span but because of the I won't advise this this is just too long too long it will fail if you do your analysis this will fail this is just one option one option this is a one option but I won't do this if I'm you what I will do is this let me delete again or we can even leave it hmm? now what we do is copy offset this this line and let's say we offset please check our previous video for you to know how to be able to insert your 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 distance what you want to do we we, we type in 255 you say okay we can come here offset please check our previous video how we arrive we were able to do this this and a values we are putting inside so if you have these double columns and double grid lines you click you put your you put your columns you put your columns escape so what you do delete 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 I come here I create a beam here to this point I create another beam here to this point come here create this this becomes a simply support beam this becomes a simply support this becomes a simply support beam simply support beam so it becomes a simply support beam so here you've created a double column to separate it from from being continuous from being continuous so this is how I would preferably do mine or if this is not what you are asking please let us know but if it is uh, still comment let us know if it solved your question that you are asking so we will stop here we are creating I am glad to announce that we we're almost done with our online courses 
step by step guide the, the the title of this course that we've created it will be out soon is the step by step guide to is a step by step guide to reinforce concrete design step by step guide to reinforce concrete design it will be out this week the links will soon be posted the links will soon be posted i'm so excited it's very interactive and very explanatory all those people asking how to go about proto structure every of the detail about how to go about it from beginning to end it is a very wonderful course that we've done please when the link is at click and get yourself one and those who are still here to subscribe please hit the subscribe button so that you can get notified when we put up our content i really really want to say if you are yet to uh, if you have been benefiting from this course and you are yet to subscribe hit the subscribe button that is the way you can show your appreciation of this course or of these videos thank you very much bye